Look, this anti-trans argument is bullshit. Personally, I don't see kids being uncomfortable around trans people, but let's say you were correct. Let's say that a kid could be uncomfortable seeing a man with breasts or a woman with a beard or something like that. A kid could also be uncomfortable seeing particular styles of clothes. A kid could also be uncomfortable seeing someone who is disabled, someone who is missing a limb. A kid could also be uncomfortable just if they see a very big person that's intimidating. Kids could be uncomfortable for tons of different reasons. But we teach them that in a society, we all have to coexist with everyone, even if we're not all the same. So if there is a massive, seven-foot-tall dude in a biker jacket walking into a bathroom and your kid is afraid of that, you tell them there's no reason to be afraid. He's a person just like you and me. If someone walks into a bathroom and is missing an arm and your kid is uncomfortable, you say there's no reason to be uncomfortable, they're a person like you and me. If a woman with a beard walks into a bathroom, which, by the way, you don't even have to be trans to have a woman with a beard. It could just be a hormonal thing that happens to cis women. You tell them they're a person like you and me. We are all taught at a very young age that people are all different and we all have to be respectful of those differences. The fact that everyone thinks that it's okay to ignore that just for trans people is just a sign of bigotry.